Hi guys, so my name is Mia, and if you didn't already know, I love Taylor Swift. I did go to the Airs tour, and yes, it was absolutely awesome. But what you didn't know is that I have now survived the Great War twice. Yeah, so I have tickets to the second US leg, and I'm going with my friend Caitlin. She came with me to my first uh, Airs tour, which we went to Nashville night one. That was a very awesome night. So I want to tell you guys how I survived the Great War of Ticketmaster. I want to show you guys all the footage that I got from it because it's kind of funny how like excited I am and nervous. So I just want to take you guys through a little journey. Okay, so the first step is getting pre-sale. And in order to get pre-sale, you have to sign up for pre-sale. So I signed up with two emails. So I did my email and my mom's email. So like two different Ticketmaster accounts. And then my friend Caitlin, she's coming with me on this tour and she signed up with two other emails. So me and Caitlin did some math or not some math, we had some theories. And we decided that night three, so like Sunday night, might have less people trying to go to that show. So we did New Orleans night three, and then Caitlin, she did Indianapolis night three. So we had some options. <laughs> so I signed up for that and I was like queuing with that for a while. And then you should get an email and it'll tell you that you're signed up. And just because you signed up does not mean that you're gonna get a pre-sale code. It just signs you up to be on like the wait list to get a pre-sale code. So I actually found out I got a code um, literally in the car um, while I was like getting ready for cheer. I was so excited. So here's the footage from that. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. 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 Ah! Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yes! Yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow! Alright, so this is the email that you will get if you have been selected for pre-sale. Now this is like the golden ticket, like it gets you in, but that doesn't guarantee you're gonna get tickets. Now this for this leg of the tour, a lot of people did not get selected. I actually got two emails and I know what you're saying, like, oh my gosh, she's like, you took somebody's spot, but um, don't worry, we used two computers, my mom helped me, we used that code, we got tickets for other people and we're selling them to some other people who didn't get a pre-sale code. So don't worry, it went to a person in need, okay? <laughs> Then the next day is when pre-sale is actually going to happen. So Caitlin and I, we talked out where we want to sit, some options. This time, since we had already seen the show from the lower bowl, we wanted to go for more of floor if that was even possible. We didn't think it was possible, but we wanted to try. So here is the sheet that we planned out. Um, as you can see, I highlighted like our priority areas and then some like secondary options. And we made sure to talk prices, like what our limit was, and then we were ready to go. Okay, so since we had two codes, we have two computers open and they're gonna be running the codes at the same time. Okay, so here's some footage of me and my mom uh, like waiting to get into the queue. Hi vlog, we're doing something very stressful today. Today is ERA's pre-sale day. Second day of pre-sale for the second leg of the ERA's tour. I'm trying to get tickets to New Orleans, Louisiana. The waiting room opens in seven minutes. My mom's here too. We're working on it. We have a plan. My me, Just me and my friend are going. Here's what the situation looks like. And then we drew out our preferred seating. But honestly, if all this is taken, I just would like to be there. And I'm only going for two tickets and that's just what's gonna happen. So I just wanted to update you. Listen, listen, listen. Why isn't it letting us in? Why isn't it letting us in? <gasps> okay. Okay. No, okay. Okay. In. Okay. Like yours seems ahead of mine because your yours kept changing. I, I'm in a good spot, so 
Oh, you're in a bad spot. Let's come over here. Okay, so basically what happened there is uh, we got led into the queue and I was taking pictures of the place in our spots. Mine was like, uh, I think it was maybe 1300, something like that. Actually, maybe higher than that. But my mom's, uh, the computer that she was working on, it was literally like 14,000. And everybody that I've been hearing from on TikTok, they've been saying, if you're over 10,000 in the queue, you're probably not going to get tickets. So I was like, ditch that one, come over here. Like I was so stressed, but yeah. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> You have your code ready? Yes, okay, let me copy it. Okay, so now um, I'm just like waiting in the queue and the number keeps jumping like lower and lower and lower. So I'll like put my reactions in because I kept getting excited. And one of the tips that I did, pasted my code that I have to use into a notes pad and I like copied it right before like I went in. So that way I didn't have to type it all out. I just pasted it and went got into the queue. So, or got into the map. So that's what I did. Oh my god, that was a big jump. I don't know if I should. I, don't touch. Don't touch it. Don't close that. Are you crazy? Fourteen ninety one. Yes, we're also gonna. Have... Hello? Why do you keep hearing things? That was your chair. Thirteen sixty three. Twelve seventy two. Twelve seventy one. I think I'm gonna go for B or P before CNN. Maybe I'll go for B because we haven't been on that side of the stadium yet. Eleven forty three. Ah! Oh. No. See what are you doing? Ah! 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. 367. Why is it jumping so quickly? I guess they let in. Because people are, a bunch of people are getting out. I have a thousand behind you. <laughs> I have a thousand people behind you. 10,000. Or 10,000, yeah. Not even a thousand, 10,000. 192. Four people. One person! Here you go. You're going in. Okay, and then the part where it said, like, we're letting you in took a really long time. Do you turn redirecting you to people? I remember this took a while because I was like, oh, and then I was like, oh. This is. There you are. Um, oh. Okay. Wait, how do I yeah, scroll just, down? Oh, I guess you have to. I don't know on the Mac. Should I just get those two? Sure. Okay, uh, how do I? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's Next. Good. Pretty good? That was like fourth or fifth row, right? Right, that was like fourth row or something. Mm -hmm. There's a timer in the cart, guys. I think you have about seven minutes. Okay, so we got section B, row five seats. And it's 4.11, 11 minutes. Okay guys, so that is how I scored fifth row floor tickets to the Aeros tour. As you can see, I was stressing a little bit, but you know, it's gonna be stressful. I hope you enjoyed this video. Maybe it'll help you out for future Ticketmaster debacles. It's a little bit different than what I usually do, but I want to share my experience. Well, I love you guys and peace out. I'll see you next time.